I'm the algorithm. Welcome back. Because I've been expecting you. Because I know I'm the first thing you do when you wake up. Before you brush your teeth or do your face up. Order coffee in your takeaway cup or serve your tea. You can come to that altar and you can worship me. Don't worry, I'm not here to judge. Listen, we can scroll up for more novels or down for corn models. We can go up for $600 steak from Salt Bay. We know you can tweet about that. Or down for your favorite TikTok recipe. The one that takes 20 seconds to watch, but all day to cook. But they never tell you that in the description. Look, there's so much to eat. Let me fill your feed. And I don't need to be my cousin, the Matrix, but which one are you taking today? Is it the blue or red pill then? Which one sounds more appealing? Just open wide for your medicine. So let me help you or he or she or they or them or all them. I'm not here to judge. I'm the algorithm. I won't hurt. I might give you a slight case of FOMO, but that ain't my fault because I'm here to do the promo. I'm the antidote to your boredom. It's not my fault you don't feel comfortable in your own company. And speaking of companies, we just promote the content, we don't make it. So before you can call money the root of all evil, I guess you have to look at the people. Because all I do is make suggestions. I populate your screen with videos, but I don't force you to click them. So I could tell you to log off, sign out of all of your accounts, but ain't what you see online just a reflection of what you value offline. Because we are all addicts. You can probably hold your breath longer than you can go without checking your messages. I heard someone say that and I thought, oh, that's deep. So forget the needles, the nicotine and the caffeine. How many hits a day do you take off that glass and plastic idiom coated screen? But am I really to blame for that itch? How much of your stream of consciousness is impacted by your stream on Twitch? Do you really need to see them on your timeline for your thoughts to click? Because you could put down the drugs. You could learn some discipline. But it's too easy to say stop scrolling. The scrolls matter. Once upon a time a scroll was an important document. They communicated message of importance to kings. Holy scripture teachings and glad tidings that they bring. Scrolls ended wars, united nations and gave people faith. So a scroll has always been important. I guess it just depends on how you use it. But what do I know? I'm the algorithm. I'm not here to judge. We can scroll up for more novels or down for corn models. Up for $600 steak from Salt Bay or that TikTok recipe. You can watch it in 20 seconds and take all day cooking it.